You, hold on a second. I thought that log was a crock. It might. Oh, it is. Really? Oh my goodness, look at that. Can we? Hello, fellow gamers. I'd like to welcome you to the joy of building. If this is, uh, let's see here, we are on season three, episode 13, lucky number 13. But if this is your first time with us, I'd like to thank you and welcome you to the channel. My best advice is to watch this episode all the way to the end and see if the series is right for you. But if you're a returning viewer of our videos, I want to thank you for watching us again and thank you for your support. I'm going to show all the tools and building materials that we're going to need for this particular video all across the bottom of the screen. So if you want to build along with me, you'll know exactly what you need. The materials and tools are just for this video, not for the entire build during this season. That way you'll know how much material and which tools you'll need to follow along. Now while that's running across the bottom of the screen, I'm going to show you our GPS coordinates, 3527, and we're going to attend to our vitals. And the vitals of the fire, it looks like. <laughs> Let's see, I think I got a couple, yeah, I got some wood on me. There we go. So, what are we looking at here? Yeah, we need we need some meat. Soup, no problem. I picked up this Malanga root. Looks like we might have just missed our, our sweetheart, yeah. I think she's already in the water. No worries. Yeah, for those that are <clears throat> first-time viewers, we, uh, we've got a little caiman that really enjoys stopping by just to say hello. <laughs> Go ahead and drink some dirty water. <coughs> Whoops. Looks like we got a little dirty ourselves. But yeah, you can drink dirty water. It'll give you parasites. But as long as you have mushrooms that cure parasites, it makes that little thing down there disappear and you don't have them anymore. I guess that's an old native trick, right? So what else do we need? Not much, not much at all, just some carbs. And yeah, we can eat these little mushrooms. And yeah, we're, we're as right as rain. So I guess the only other thing I need to do is to refill the, whoops, refill the, there we go, finally. And having some really good success with this trap over here. Not yet. I got a little little nut in there. Sometimes you feel like a nut, right? Let's let's see if they feel like a nut. But yeah, um, I know we've kind of spent a little time on traps. We spent a little time on base building. I want to continue the base building in this episode because this thing is really coming together. Um, of course, I went ahead and gathered a bunch of mud bricks so y'all don't have to watch all that and we can just gab away right so let's see we've got our double doors set up and reverend saul made that recommendation um, which i think is is just a, a brilliant brilliant idea um, i love the idea of having these mud brick walls i mean uh like double doors right there i think aesthetically it looks really really cool um just overall just a nice aesthetic for the base yeah i'm loving it Beautiful, look at that lovely thing. Beautiful base, beautiful base. So, another, <laughs> random rustling. Another thing we can build, um, and, and, and I've mentioned this a couple of times in other videos in this season, um, I wanna do something a little different where the ladders are on the side, not on little, those nooks, or what are they called, those notches. We're not going to build any of these mud roof with notches. I don't really like the way that looks. So we're going to do this right here. I like that. So we got three. So we're going to need two long boys. And at least one more regular stick, which we have right there. So for two, to get two long boys, I'm just going to take three. And I'm going to put one back because we're not going to need all three. And then we're going to build a lovely, lovely ladder. And of course we don't have robes. Why would why would we need robes? That doesn't make any sense. Gosh. Silly, silly, silly. 
So, I did kind of some some pre-work just to kind of flesh this area out in my mind and you know we're gonna we're gonna build up a little bit more so we've got this guy right here obviously we're gonna build up a little bit more we're gonna finish this floor up here but I want to show y'all something what well, you know what let's yeah we can't use the ladder until we make it there we go so I want to show y'all something um, I know somebody had a really good idea um, because it, it looks like whoops in some hello there we go in some areas you, hold on a second I thought that log was a crock it might oh it is really Oh my goodness, look at that. Can we? We sure can. Oh my goodness. Wow. Talk about uh, extreme fishing right there, right? Oh my goodness, that's wild. I don't know that I've ever done anything like that before. Now I just wanna, I just wanna get my arrow and I don't wanna get killed. Okay, good. Okay, okay, good. Where's the old arrow? There we go. And we're going to leave her there. Yeah, we, we got to get to that too, because this is proven ineffective. But anyway, like I was saying, <laughs> somebody somebody had some really, really smart advice. I'm sorry, I can't remember who it was, but um, you had noticed that, you know, in some areas you can build a shed where a frame already is, and you're like, hey, let's do it for this one, because we were talking about building a shed over here, and it, you can't. So there's just something... I think Saul, Reverend Saul had said maybe because of this tree, and I think I think you're right. I think that's somehow interfering. I don't think it should, but but it is. So that stinks. <laughs> it is what it is. Um, let's go over here. We're gonna build. Yeah, let's go ahead and build a roof. A mud roof. Oh, we had it. Okay, great. There we go were a roofer but yeah I, I mean I know I've only said it about 70 or 80, 80 times but I really love the way this base is coming together I mean it's looking really unique really awesome and of course it brings me joy okay and I think we just need one more that's that's the way it's looking so let's just go ahead and take the quick way <clears throat> and there we go we've got that that roof so I'm gonna build frames out here. I'm not quite sure about right here yet, but I'm not gonna build one. I don't think I wanna build one here necessarily, simply because, gosh, that looks just like a log. That's so scary. Um, because I wanna be able to fish from here, and I don't know if you can. Um, and I, I had asked um, somebody about possibly building <coughs> fences up there, but I don't think that we can. I think the only way we'd be able to build a fence is if we could build a frame. And of course, that's where we're limited, where we're at right now. So yeah, I'm gonna put at least one more right here. Um, what, we need logs first, that's right, logs. Okay, and I'm just gonna take these three right now. But then I'll get the rest of them, all, you know, the, the long sticks and the other log all in one fell swoop. Let's see. We need one more log and four sticks. We're going to take that. We're going to drop it. We're going to take max, and we only need four, so we're going to put one back. Look at that guy gyrating. He's twerking. <laughs> and we're going to be just right under the 50 pound weight limit. Love it. Love it. Or 50 units, whatever that is. Okay, so we've got this here. Nah, we don't need that yet. And then we can get back to the mud. Which I think we should we should do. Okay. There we go. 
Mud roof, mud roof. Oh, I almost went down the wrong way. So we're going to need seven of those. We're definitely going to be overweight. Let's use the old Stretch Armstrong trick. One, two. Can't pick that one up. Three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, we're going to be quite a bit overweight, but that's okay. We're saving time. No! That was a close one. Okay. So here we go. Yeah, I wish we could build a shed, but it doesn't <clears throat> doesn't look like we're going to be able to. So it's those happy accidents we were talking about in the last episode, right? We're just going to make make lemonade with that. So maybe Oh, I just got a silly idea. <laughs> so we've got our double doors here. What if we put um Doors on the outside over... The, no, that's not going to work. Come on, gamer. That's not going to work. That doesn't even make sense. It's just me spitballing over here. You know me. We get a little crazy sometimes when we're having too much fun. So what do I want to do with this? Maybe You know what? Maybe with this area, we leave it open like this, but I can have, like, fishing supplies and stuff like that up here. Maybe, um... And then over here, we're going to have our, um whatchamacallit <clears throat> we're gonna have our I can never it's like a, a mud fireplace what is that thing called mud fireside wall that's such a that's such a sexier classier name than what I gave it mm. and tonight I am drinking vodka cranberry so not only is oh and not only is this episode 13 it is February 13th I should be able to actually you know what I'm not I'm filming it on the 13th but I'm it's not gonna come out until either 8 a.m. or 10 a.m. tomorrow probably 8 a.m. so my bad so we can maybe we can we'll just leave that open air for now um, over here let's start working on some, some walls we're gonna try to work on them as soon as we find them here we go we're gonna put a side doorway right here Hmm. Maybe I might bring these out. I think I'm going to bring these out. Yeah, I think so. Because I, you know what? I, I bet you I can put a frame there. That tr Yeah. Let's play around with that idea. I like that. I like that. Cool. Okay. Awesome. So let's just drop down. This is kind of a scary area to work, scary area to work, but um, our Cayman is at least temporarily taken care of, so I feel safe. Um, take Max. Okay, so I know we just need two, or does it just one? No, it's just one, okay. So that leaves me with four over here, but that's why I took Max. Surprise, surprise. Look at that. I'm like Rachel Ray over here, except, you know, building. <laughs> just, I'm going to shut my mouth now. <laughs> just pick some more rope up. Get back to work, right? There we go. I'm glad I picked up all that rope. So we are going to take three, drop them, and we're going to take one more, drop that guy, and just take them all up at the same time. What do you say? These time-saving Rachel Ray... <laughs> <laughs> methods. Ah, oh, there's something wrong with me. Anybody that knows anything knows that, though. <laughs> but yeah, I haven't forgotten about the Cayman and how we're going to protect ourselves from her. Um, I really do think that we're just going to have to put out, like, two of those uh, stakes, the pit, pit, the pit stakes. I don't know what, I can't remember what they're called. But I think we're just going to have to do that because I think two of them will kill her. But I just know for a fact that also sometimes like it'll spawn like a cat, a dead capybara on top of it. Um, I don't know. I kind of want to try the arrow trap first because if that doesn't work, we just tear that down. Because you know we're. I think everybody's in agreement that the stick, you know, the pit trap is going to work just fine. I just don't know if it's going to kill her or not with one hit. So that's like the only mystery with me. Wouldn't this be so funny if we could build like just a little doorway? We can't. Of course not. That would have been silly. 
Let's see here. Let's just make sure. Yeah, we can't. Okay, let's... What about a wall? Yeah, but still, that's kind of funny. Look at that. I love it. Yeah, that's, that's adorable. Okay. So, can we build anything right here, though, is the question. Yes, we can. Okay. So maybe I do do the reverse thing. No, wait, you can't. You're being silly again, Mr. Gamer. I promise this is my first vodka cranberry. I swear it is. Because <laughs> it is. That's okay. That's okay. It's okay. Get back to work. Get back to work. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay, so we've got that. You know what? Let's build another one of these since we're committed to that. We'll bring it all the way out. I thought about staggering it, but I want more room over on this side for more stuff. Okay. So let's just do that same thing that we did a second ago. Whoops. I meant to not bring that out so far. I mean, I meant to bring it out farther. I didn't mean to drop them so quickly. I got excited. Good lord, that log is like suspended in the air. Okay. Oh, we are way overweighties. Yeah. Hopefully I'll be able to climb over these mud bricks over here. Oh, there's a little little sneaky area right there that we can get to. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Don't worry, I see the leeches. We'll get to them. And we've been dirty, 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 dirty. For a, oops! A little too quick on the draw there. There we go. I guess you have to wait a second. So let's get these leecherinos off our dirty arms and legs. Hello. Ah, there you are. Hello, everybody. <sighs> there we go. Perfect. Okay, so we need four of those. No problem. We got to do something with that, too. I haven't forgotten about that. I have an idea. Um... We need four of these, right? I think that's what that's where we're at right now. So we're going to take Max, put one back. I think that's where we're at. Boom. Yes, that's where we are. Okay. And this base is just coming together right now. Is it not? Look at this beautiful thing. I'm loving it. I am loving it. Ugh. So good. Yep, can't pick that one up over there. Still can't. That's okay. We'll go over there. Whoops. Yeah. Okay. So there is a there is a limit, a distance limit. <laughs> Literally half a pound too much. That's all right. We're close. Okay. So I have to remember to put ladders on these areas right here so that we can climb up to the top because if I don't we're gonna be locked out of the roof which I don't want to happen okay where there you are roof ah so good I know I'm like patting myself on the back like crazy but I'm telling you that was weird so what, we need two more? I'm telling you, I'm excited. I love this build. Me encanta. I'm loving it. Perfect. And she's looking so pretty. Look at that. I'm loving it. Oh, so good. Okay, okay, okay. So, oh, you know what? While we're down here, let's just go ahead. Will it let us? Yes, it will. Okay. And we're going to need seven more, which I think we should have. It's going to be pretty darn close. Yeah, I think we got seven more. Whoops. Two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And it's getting late. It's getting late. I was really hoping to build the, the fireside whatever. And... Um, but I don't know if we're going to be able to get to it. I wanted to build the bed too, but um, if we can't get to it, we can't get to it. I was kind of, you saw how I kind of laid all the mud out. I kind of had a plan of action, but I got really excited setting this side up. I was like, wait, uh, we got to set this side up. And that's what we're doing. Boom. 
And over here, you know, oh darn it, you know what, I just realized something. I was gonna set up um, palm leaves or banana leaves for the roof, and I just realized that as soon as I, fi I'm so sorry about that. I know we needed to add some color. My apologies, I got way too excited. That's my fault. So if you're watching this right now, um, I know who you are, and I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. I'm like not even kidding because I wanted to do that too, but I don't want to break all that mud. Please don't hate me. Please don't unsubscribe. <laughs> I mean, you can unsubscribe if you want. It's not going to hurt my feelings. I love all this. I think we're up to like 175, 174, and I'm just tickled by that. Like, I'm, like, I remember having like five, <laughs> and they were all like friends of mine that you know, probably just felt sorry for me. <laughs> I told them about the channel and they added themselves. So this is nice because I've, I've met a lot of really amazing people Whoops, um, who I haven't met personally, just electronically. And, and I consider you all to be awesome, awesome people that have amazing advice and good insights. It's just been a real treat. So for that, I'm very thankful. Thank you. It's not easy to to put, you know. I imagine it's not it's not easy to put something like this together. It definitely I can speak from personal experience. You know, it's not because not long ago I didn't know anything about video editing, screen capture. It was just like one of those things that other people did that I enjoyed. And then one day I just got up and I'm like, you know what? I want to do that. So after many weeks slash months of looking into it, um, here we are. So happy, happy, joy, joy, right? So I'm just I'm just glad people enjoy this. That's why I keep making these things. I think that's all of them, right? Right. I think so. Okay. No problem. If it's not, we'll get over it. God, I'm thirsty. Oh, no, you're right. right. You are thirsty. Okay. After this, after this, we'll take care of it. Well, at least this didn't cover up the ladder. That would have been a disaster. We would have figured out a way. It would have just been a mild irritant. All right, so we've got these. Boom, boom, boom. We got that wall set up. It looks like we got four. So let's do this. Let's give ourselves a little scrub-a-dub. Oh, and Claire is not in the room with me. She's asleep in the next room because she wants to have a conversation with a dog three houses down that's outside barking. And that just doesn't make for a good video. <laughs> so she's asleep in the living room. Don't worry, I didn't like abandon her or anything. <laughs> we got four unknown mushrooms. That's perfect because this gives you 50 no, units idea. of water. And we need almost 100, so even if we get parasites Disgusting. twice, Ugh. we didn't. Um, but if we get it, if, even if we had gotten them four times, that would have been okay. There we go. We're back to normal. And let's eat a bunch of these because uh, that gives us energies. Yeah, I had a feeling this was getting ready to die. I love this coal. It's wonderful. Let's just drop all these in there. There we go. And this is meat soup, and that's just clean water. I forgot to put this malanga bulb in there. Separate these. How are we doing? Yeah, we still got a day on those. That's fine. And how much gives you 40 carbs? That's about what we need. We'll take one of those hits when we still got another helping because we were fully hydrated. That's another tip. Always fully hydrate, okay, before you sip any soup because if you're fully hydrated when you sip the soup you'll get the nutrients but you'll be able to eat it twice oh and another thing i killed a tapir off screen and it gave me 11 meat 11 as in this is spinal tap amplifier 11 it's crazy it's madness okay we're fully energized. We're not thirsty anymore. Jake's happy as a clam. So, yes. Before I forget, I'm going to lay the at least the framework down 
for this one, and I'll just do the middle wooden doorway for this guy. You know what we could do over here? Maybe we could do all bamboo in the middle. I mean, I mean for the walls. You know, we'll have those low walls like you were talking about. They'll be all bamboo, but even the doorway will be bamboo. Yeah, maybe we can do something like that. Okay, so I think I'm going to put my... I'm going to put a wall here because this is where I want my... Um, you guys know what I'm trying to say. My fireside stove, whatever it's called. <laughs> so let's just go ahead. We're going to take Max, and we're also going to... Come on, we're going to take one more to give us five. Because there was only four in that one. So let's go on over here. There we go, and we need one of them. We still need 14 to do all of them. And... Gosh, we barely, that's that's what we got, pretty much. Good lordy, lordy lordy, have mercy. Come on, come on. So we'll go ahead and complete this. And then we'll get started on this. And this needs six, so we just need to take five more. And we'll be good. Man, oh my goodness, we're only going to have five left. And what do we have, like two logs left? Or maybe if we have four... Maybe it's, is that four? Maybe it's more than that. There's at least four there, which is good because I, I need to build some storage boxes. Which we shall probably have to do in a different video. It's not gonna be this one. Oh no, I need one more. Okay, cool. No problem. I'm not good at math. I got a C in finance. <laughs> You know it's so weird. I got a C in college algebra, but I got and you're not you're not gonna believe me when I say this, but it's true. I got an A in business calculus. So I know it's not like calculus calculus, but that was one of the weed out classes, and I got an A in it. I didn't even have to take the final exam because my score was so high. It just made sense to me. I mean that's the best way I can describe it. It's the strangest thing in the world, you know, doing three D graphs and things like that. I mean it just now college algebra, I'm like, Y equals M X B, what does that mean? <laughs> so <laughs> I mean sorry. Yeah, it was good times. People were like, Who is? I mean, there were a lot of people in those classes with me that knew me from other classes and they knew I was kind of a goofball. I wasn't the smartest guy in the world. They're like, How's this guy doing that? Okay, so I want to do something, we might as well, you know, I'm thinking about making like a metal axe with that. I don't know how the durability is on our arrows, I'm sure it's kind of low, but I don't know if we really need, you know, metal arrows. Our skill is like 40 or something um, with arrows, which apparently is good enough to take. To, yeah, okay, it's 60 now. Oh, throwing 23, that's awesome. I guess once you get to 40 harvesting, that's when you get like freaking a bazillion uh, meat for every single thing that you harvest. It doesn't seem to affect fish though. You just get one fillet. From, like, for example, if we're to get that piranha, I don't get two. I only get one. Which is fine. That was something else I was thinking about doing. was a, a pescatarian challenge where I eat nothing but, but fish. You know, you don't eat any red meat. Whoops. I think that's all six of them. I actually submitted that as a recommendation for an achievement. The pescatarian challenge, eat no red meat for, I think it was like 30 game days or something. Um, I hope they put that in the game. That would be a lot of fun. And plus, I, you know, I'd, I'd get a little little credit, little notoriety for a uh, little street cred for coming up with an achievement. Hopefully they put it in. I did a bunch. Like, if you go to the Steam forums, I made a bunch of recommendations for um, achievements. Like, at least 10 or 12. So we've got this here. I think this is going to be the last thing that we do. Go ahead and harvest this bad boy. I know I don't have any space. That's all right. 
Where did they go? Okay, good. So we got that, we got that. Do we have... I don't even remember what we have on the weapons rack. All I know is we have a fishing pole. We don't have a stone axe. But that's okay. I'll just put this one right here. We have that. Okay, so we just need to find... Actually, do we need to find a stone? We sure don't. We sure don't. Craft. So yeah, you can make a metal axe mold by just... I think it, it's these two, right? Craft these two together. And then... We craft... Whoops. Craft... Oh, need one more. I mean... I guess we need some metal, right? Uh, it's hard to see with the crafting window up. I guess we need some metal to, you know, make an axe mold, right? Boom. Oh, you know what? There is one last thing we need to do. Okay, that's two. We need to put two more in there. There is something else we need to do. Just a, just I know I know I'm kind of frustrating one of our one of our viewers. Ooh, one percent. Hopefully this will work. This might be it might break after this. Come on. Oh no. Yep, Come it broke. On. It broke. Are you kidding me. It broke. Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Whoa, weird. He's is he bugged out? He's, he's saying yes, but it's actually no. That's okay. We'll make a real simple one. Just a hand drill for now. Is that going to go away? Is that going to... Weird. It is legitimately bugged down. Okay. I'll submit a bug report. Well, let's see here. Hopefully we've got enough energy, because I know this takes a little bit more energy to use. Come on! There we go. And yeah, that's weird. Look, we can't pick it up. Very, very strange. Very strange indeed. Okay, so we're, we're making our little axe mold. Um, but there is something else that uh, has been bugging at least one of, our, one of our viewers. So I want to make sure we take care of it because they remind me. They've reminded me like two, maybe three times. Let's see, 73. Let's pick up the 51%. There's a lot of foliage out here, and it's hard to see our sweetheart. Plus, we need tinder anyway. So let's just go ahead and clear, the, clear this out, clean this area up. Hopefully she won't kill us, because she shouldn't be spawned back yet. There we go. I think that's pretty good for now, right? I think so. And it is way past our bedtime, so I think it's time to sign off. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and consider subscribing to the channel. It would mean a lot to me. Um, if you're building a base somewhere in Green Hell, I'd really love to see it. Take a screenshot and send it to my Twitter account. It's at unkempt1, and it's also uh, down in the, the Twitter handles down in the description of this video. Until then, from me to you, I'd like to wish you happy building safe building, and many blessings.